Okay, class. Today, we have an important topic. I want to ask you guys, what do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be a firefighter. I want to be a rock. I want to be a ballerina. Um, excuse me, Miss Teacher Lady. I want to be a teacher, just like you. Oh, sweet, sweet Susie. Being a teacher would make you a failure. We don't even get paid enough to sustain ourselves. And we have to deal with rats just like you. You'd be better off doing something else, Susie. Yo! What's up, guys? It's your boy, Orange Guy Animations. And some people are not cut out to give advice because their advice leaves these poor innocent souls shattered and hopeless for their future. And unfortunately, I experienced that secondhand. But before we get started, there's only one more day to get a 1K Gang shirt! So make sure you go check out the shop. Link in the description down below. And also, here's the winners of last week's giveaway. So make sure you four reach out to me on either Instagram or Discord to claim your prize. And let's get back into that video. So this took place during color class. The same color class that this teacher taught. Oh brother, this guy stinks! We already know this isn't gonna end well. So it was a normal day in class with no teacher for the first hour because this teacher was late every single day. Oh my God. But you guys already knew that because you watched the first video, right? So the teacher finally showed up and she would post up on the end of my table and do literally nothing because she was an L teacher. But because she was just sitting around wasting her life away, if you needed to, you could basically go and ask her anything. So during this time, I was actually finishing up my Big Brain Orange Guy project. And I was deep into my work, making sure this fine piece looks as amazing as it does. And as I was working on my project, a student came over to ask the teacher a question. But oh, this question wasn't as simple as, do you know where the crayons went? Um, excuse me? Can can I ask you something? Oh, <laughs> of course you can. Since I literally do nothing instead of teaching like I should, I have all the time in the world. Okay, well, um, it's just, it's just I always see people going into medical school or business, and I really want to pursue art, but I, I just don't know if I'm making the right decision, you know? Now, usually when stuff like this happens, I try not to pay attention because it's not really my business. And honestly, bro, we do not care. But they were right in front of me. And hearing what she said, I was like, dang, this poor girl. Clearly, she's not confident in her decision, and she probably doesn't have a good supportive group around her. You know what a good, sensible human being would do in this situation? Give her some motivation. Lift her spirits. Push her to strive for her goals. Yeah, that's hard. I, I understand. You know, for me, I just understand that I'll never be able to support myself by just my art alone. What the freak is she telling her? <laughs> Even now, I try not to go crazy because it feels like I can never even buy my groceries. This has to be the worst advice from the worst person. This fool can't even show up to work on time. Oh my God. She basically told this poor little girl that she's gonna become a failure. This, this, this can't be. And the worst part 
is after listening to the worst advice ever uttered from another human, I looked over to the girl and she looked like she was seriously listening to everything that this goofball was saying. Why ain't no way, boy? Oh man, I wanted to jump in so bad, but I just continued working on my project because they started talking about other stuff. But this Looney Tune is crazy. I think she was actually evil, bro. Because how are you gonna be handed the title of teacher, barely show up to your class, pull up to the last five minutes of class, and then ruin a child's future? Gotta be evil, bro. Gotta be, I I'm just saying. Moral of the story, if you ever feel like you should really say something, you should probably say it. I can't say if it's right or wrong to do so, but that gut feeling do be spitting sometimes though. And with that being said, I'll catch you in the next video. Yo, what's up guys? It's your boy N Cards, Orange Guy. Yes sir, yes sir. Bro, dude, I just blinked right there. There's literally, after I said bro, there's nothing I wanted to say after that. It was empty, bro. Anyway, go follow all this stuff and um, yeah, make sure you go check out OGA Drip Shop in the description. Pretty cool, pretty cool place. And uh, subscribe. Yeah, you should uh, subscribe. You better subscribe right now. Subscribe!